Erling Haaland was involved in all five goals in Dortmund's win over Frankfurt last week. One of the men charged with stopping him this week became Freiburg's all-time record appearance maker in the Bundesliga, Christian Günther, with his 237th top-flight outing for the club. And the home side had extra reason for early celebration. Just six minutes in, they took the lead in spectacular style. Vincenzo Grifo with perfect precision to score directly from a free kick for the fourth time in his Bundesliga career. Dortmund enjoyed the lion's share of possession and created plenty of chances thereafter, with the best of them falling Jude Bellingham's way. But the England international was unable to crown his 50th competitive outing for Borussia with a goal. In the resulting counter-attack following that Bellingham opportunity, Freiburg broke away and almost doubled their lead just after the half-hour mark. Wu Yong Jong scored in the corresponding fixture last season, but was unable to finish from Gunter's cross. Dortmund a goal down at the break, the game not going to plan for the club hierarchy. And things got even worse shortly after the restart. Dortmund were all too often caught in possession and forced into mistakes, which Freiburg then capitalised on. A textbook counter involving Jong and Hurler ended in Roland Schaloy, making it 2-0. The Hungarian international impressed at the European Championships and got off the mark on his first Bundesliga outing of the season. Just over five minutes later, Dortmund were handed a lifeline. Again, it was Bellingham in the thick of the action, but it was Freiburg's Yannick Keitel who ultimately steered the ball past Mark Flecken for an own goal. It meant that Dortmund had found the net for a 34th consecutive Bundesliga game. But they weren't able to force an equaliser. A disciplined Freiburg side nullified the threat of Erling Haaland all afternoon and were good value for the 2-1 win.